three bona fide leading ladies. <laughs> <laughs> we have Beverly Knight, Cassidy Jansen, and Amber Riley with me. But we're here because something very exciting happened this morning, didn't it, ladies? We had yeah. an announcement. <laughs> yeah. Really exciting. Only are you real leading ladies in real life on the West End stage? But also, you're now the world's newest girl band. All <laughs> 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 right. the leading ladies. Would you maybe, Amber, you could start by telling us a little bit more about this and how it all came about? Well, of course, all of us are leading ladies on the West End. Have been leading ladies on the West End. It's my first time being on the West End as a leading lady. And uh, I was approached about, you know, coming together with these two amazing ladies, Beverly Knight and Cassidy Jensen. And after hearing them, of course, I'm like, I would jump at a chance to be able to sing with these powerful voices, of course. And um, it just kind of happened so, like, I guess, like, organically. We, we gel so great in the studio. Our voices blend, even though we all sound you know, different. Our voices blend so well together, which I hope everybody will feel when they hear us later on <laughs> today. <laughs> but I mean, you know, it's um, it's just been really, it's been really exciting, and it's it, it happened so fast, but it's just been so great. It really is a sort of a real baptism of fire for you guys, isn't it? Because until this morning, it was the biggest secret. You must have been yeah. oh, able gosh. to tell anyone, and now you're on stage. Yeah, yeah. it's oh. it's been very very sudden. Like we've been. Um, having to sort of keep it relatively under wraps for, for months now. So it's been quite tricky. And so today was kind of this huge relief of like, it's finally been announced, you know, and then we go straight into our first performance tonight, which uh, we just had a, an amazing sound check and the band sound incredible, mm -hmm. incredible. It's, it's very exciting. It's going to be hugely popular because, you know, everyone loves a show tune and this is an album full of show, show tunes and your performance tonight is going to be that. How do you go about picking which are your best and which one you which your favourite song? <laughs> yeah. Um, that was not straightforward. We had a long list of about, what, 40 songs yeah. to start? Yeah. 40 yeah. songs. And then we cut it down. We were supposed to cut it down to a good, like, 18. And then we kept saying, oh, yeah, we, we'll get rid of this one, get rid of that one. And then we're like, oh, but what about this one? And then the list goes back up again. You're like, oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> so it was just back forth, back forth. Eventually... We got down to 15 songs, I think we're at. Um, and I guess the ones that we've got the most of a, a, a personal connection yes. to, just songs that we just like, um, songs which you think, well, it's not really a, an album of musical theatre songs if you don't have this one in it. Mm -hmm. So it, it got to that point um, where we were just like... <laughs> Flip a coin? No. Yeah. Um, it <laughs> was sort of like battling it out. I like. I've got to have this one. No, I want. Do you know? One. It was none of that. No. It was more like we all loved a song, but it was very similar to another, another song. song. Mm -hmm. So we were like, well, we have to have one of them, and it was so yeah. difficult making that choice of dropping two very, very fully loved songs between mm. the three. Yeah, of yeah. I think that's what it was. Like, yeah. you know, Sophie's what they say, Sophie's choice. Yeah, yeah exactly. It was kind of just like, oh, but I love that song. But this song does kind of sound like that song, so. We have to choose, but I think that we did a good job. Yeah, we did. I think we picked some really good ones. There's some modern stuff. There's some more classical stuff. Yeah. Classical, but classic stuff. And there's a real broad spectrum. I think we kind of tick every box. Yeah, we think. We so, yeah. Yeah. Did you did you ladies go to musical theatre when you were kids? Are there any that you <coughs> sort of have got in your mind as this is the song that I saw when I first went to Broadway or to the West End, and you know, it has to be that one. Mm -hmm. I um on this album the song one of the songs that I I absolutely adore uh, well I love the whole the whole musical is West Side Story and we haven't represented it on this album because it's it's one of those musicals which everybody's done somewhere you know there's always a version of somewhere somewhere um but we we uh, I, oh God, I love West Side Story so much but um as a kid you know going to see shows in general you just be like one day that's going to be me yeah. and now it's all three of us yeah. and that's a beautiful thing that's really really great yeah. now, i'm interested in the dynamic of the group between the three of you when there are <coughs> three friends together there's often a mother or a joker or an mm -hmm. organizer mm -hmm. who, what, what are your, your cards what roles do you play <laughs> well you 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 refer to bev it's Mama Bear. Yeah, she's like Mama. Mama Bear. I think, I and that's so. really, really knowledgeable about like music. And you kind of can look to her to kind of let us know like in sound check or what this is and what kind of kind of like organizing. She's really good at that. I think um, Cassie is the Joker. The Joker. <laughs> like, and, and, also, and like the creative <laughs> yeah. and like, you know, I don't know what I am. Lord. I, 
<laughs> I know I'm. I can be funny. I'm kind of like chill. I'm from Cali. Like <laughs> we're just <Yeah>. laid back. <laughs> So when it comes to an evening, an event like tonight, there must be, I sort of, part of me thinks you must have cured nerves now. You've been on stage so many times, mm-hmm. you know, but do you get nervous and do you have little ways of calming yourself down? I, yeah, I get nervous. I get yeah. nervous. I'm nervous right yeah. now. Yeah. I'm nervous every time yeah. I sing. Yeah, I think. Yeah. I think it's kind of, it would kind of be weird if you weren't, because it mm-hmm. would mean that you didn't care. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I think it's a good sign when you, or sometimes I say I feel excited, because yeah. it's, 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 it's like a positive. It's yeah, an yeah, yeah, thing. Yeah. I wanted to do well, yeah. I wanted to make sure everyone has a great time. And, yeah, of course. Yeah. Um, like anxious, like ready to do it. Yeah, yeah. Like, okay, yeah. let's just get this yeah. done. Yeah, let's yeah. Let's do this, and let's show these people, you know, what we're about, what we've yeah. been working yeah. so hard for. Yeah. I have a cup of tea. Do That's you? my That's thing. Mm. Like a nice cup of chat. That's so wonderful. So, I am. S- nice cup of. <laughs> nice That's it. Once I've had my tea, I'm fine. <laughs> fine. I'm good. How about breathing exercises and things? Do you do any of that to sort of calm? calm warming the up. I mean, just warming up. Yeah, yeah. Just, I think yeah. singing, doing general, general warm up. General warm up, make sure you feel. As long as I feel kind of set. Mm-hmm. I'm I'm good to go, and sometimes I do. I just want to get on stage because that seems to make everything just yeah. get really clear. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're like, oh yeah, okay, I'm at home. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So the album comes out in November, beginning of mm-hmm. November seventeenth. That's right. Yes. Um, just before Christmas. Yeah. Yes. Which makes oh, me think, and you have a Christmas number on your album as yeah. well. Yeah. We hoping we might get a little Christmas number one out of this, guys. Yeah. 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 Yeah.